Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Emily from Emily Cromwell Designs and I design colorful and happy bookish merch for readers. So, real quick, before we get into the business side of today's vlog, which is really every vlog we do because it's a small business that I'm running, <laughs> I wanted to share some exciting um, life news with you guys. So, uh, guess what I did yesterday? I went to a wedding dress shop and I literally found my dream wedding dress and I put down a deposit on it and I got my dress and I'm really excited. <laughs> I um, I won't talk too much about it. I'll save that for another, when I do another wedding vlog, but I just real quick want to say, I literally, I went into this wanting a like form fitting slim dress. <laughs> Let's just say that is not what I got. I ended up loving the total opposite of that. Two things I'll say is it's very sparkly and there's a lot of lace and I'm in love with it and I can't stop grinning. So I'm in a very, very good mood today. I'm so excited. <laughs> <laughs> but okay so I just want to tell you guys that real quick so today we are going to be packing up orders from my shop update that we had last weekend today is actually Friday I've been packing orders all week long I'm hoping to be able to finish packing up all the launch orders by the end of today I am getting a little bit of a late start because I had to do some stuff preparing for tax season coming up and get that together but um, I'm gonna do my very best to work around the clock today to see if I can get everything finished and packed. I think I can, because again, it was like a pretty small shop update, so it's not like some of them where it's like 80 new products and I'm going all over the studio. And then I actually, I was really hoping to get the Easter book sleeves shipped this week. We I only had the restock for those, it was a few days ago. I was really wanting to get like all Easter stuff shipped this week because it's just, it's in March this year and I'm kind of feeling the pressure from that, but I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get to those, but I'm gonna try. So we'll see how much we can get done. Um, if not, I'll just get all those out on Monday. But then tomorrow, I don't know why I keep looking over there. It's not reminding me of what I'm thinking of, but tomorrow is the mystery grab bag sale. I am really excited for that. I'm really, really hoping that goes well because I just made so much more than I usually do. I'm gonna view it in a positive way and I'm like, maybe this way everyone that wants a grab bag will finally be able to get a grab bag because usually they sell out really quick. So I'm hoping this means that all of you guys are able to get one that wants one. So we are, I really have everything together for that launch because we did that in the last video. All I have to do this evening is actually list the products because you know me and procrastinating I haven't listed anything yet but thankfully the mystery grab bag listings I already have on my site but they're just saved as drafts from the last grab bag sale and I can just go in and update the quantities and stuff like that so that's not a huge new listing I have to do but as I said today we're gonna start packing things so we need to I think we're making are we making magnetic bookmarks today I don't know I think we have some sticker sheets to cut, magnetic bookmarks. We don't have a lot of that stuff to do on the cutting machine because it's mostly just like pulling bookmarks and notepads. So we are gonna get started on that and we're gonna start packing orders.
so I am like about an hour and 40 minutes away from finishing Covet by Tracy Wolf. And can I just vent for a second? It's not that often that I get like really irritated with a character in a book, but I'm very, very annoyed with the main character, Grace. Again, if you haven't read this and you don't want a spoiler, probably skip ahead a minute or so. But I just need to vent with somebody. And you guys are my people. And... <sighs> So she is, I mean, I'm not going to give too much away, but I'm getting really annoyed with the fact that she is more concerned with how her ex-love interest is feeling and his well-being than she is with her current love interest. And I'm getting so irritated because I'm like, girl, do you not see that your current love interest, you're hurting him by caring more about your ex-love interest? And it's just really annoying me. And I'm just like getting really frustrated. Like I have, I've already read like the blurbs and spoilers. So I know what they're trying to do doesn't end up w working. Thank goodness. But it doesn't take away the frustration I have that she's trying to go through with. I don't, again, I don't want to say too much and like ruin it for someone that wants to read the book. I don't know what all to say, but basically she's trying to break a connection between them. And in the fantasy world, you probably know what I'm talking about. It starts with M. M-A-T-E connection. And I'm just getting really frustrated. I'm like, girl! <sighs> Do you ever have that? Where you're like reading a book and you just want to like go into the book and take their shoulders and be like, wake up! <sighs> and just show them what a good thing they have in front of them. Yeah, that's how I'm feeling right now. But anyways... Like I said earlier, uh, we didn't have many magnetic bookmarks and sticker sheets to make today. So that means I can just spend the rest of the day packing orders, which is good. So I'm gonna write the thank you notes really quick and then we're gonna start packing up all the orders.
so I'm on my lunch break. I'm gonna find Toby and then we're gonna get back to working. Okay. Can you say hi to YouTube? See, I've got the zoomies. I'm a little wild child right now. <laughs> All right, there you go. So I just finished Covet by Tracy Wolf. The girl finally came around. Thank goodness. It took about 23 hours of the audiobook for her to come around, but she finally came around and realized that she belonged with her one true love. And um, I can finally relax now. So I just finished that book. I am going to start the fourth book. What is this one called? This one is called Court. It is 24 hours long. These are long audiobooks. Oh my gosh. But I love every second of them. I really, really do. <laughs>
right, so the last order that we are packing out for the day is from Julie, and she left me a note saying, if you happen to film this being packed, could you give a shout out to my daughter, Addison? We watch your videos together each week, so I just wanted to say a quick hi. So hi, Addison, and hi, Julie. Thank you guys so very much for watching my channel and for supporting me. I am so grateful to have you guys here, and let's get your order packed. Okay guys, so we are all done packing orders today and I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow for the mystery car back sale. Good morning guys, it is Saturday morning. We are about 10 minutes out from when the mystery grab back sale goes live. I'm feeling more positive going into this sale than some of the past launches that I've done because I seem to get a little bit more traction on, on social media when posting about this sale than some of the past launches. Cause I mean, I'm sure any of you on social media the past few months have felt that drop in being seen and reach and it's been difficult to deal with so I um and it's a bit nerve-wracking as a small business owner when you're kind of your whole livelihood relies on this so um I'm feeling a bit more positive going into this sale so I just need to get everything on the back end ready to go for like the home page saying like mystery grab bags and then we're really good to go because this is really just two products going live instead of like a ton so it's not as nerve-wracking for me which is good because I'm trying to have like a stress-free weekend this weekend and I'm actually not doing anything business related this weekend besides this and you know drawing the whole time but I don't even view like drawing artwork for my business as business related because it just makes me so happy and filled with joy so but I'm gonna get that ready and then we're gonna have the lunch so we still have like four minutes to go but there are already over 30 people waiting so yay <laughs> 44 people waiting. Oh my gosh. Wow. Okay. Okay. I'm glad people are excited. <laughs> Launches to me always feel like that moment in the Hunger Games, like the first movie when like the clock is ticking down and I'm just like, oh my gosh. Oh, of course, and a cloud just went by, so I'm getting dark. Oh well. You can still see me. We'll make it work. <laughs> Thank you. First grab bag sale. Thank you. We have 82 people on. Okay. Let me check the site to make sure everything is correct because honestly, you never know. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, mystery grab bag, calendar, books, camera. Okay, that's looking correct. Let's check the bookmark grab bags. All right, everything. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh my god. Thank you. Oh my gosh. We have a hundred people on right now. Oh my god. <laughs> thank you. Thank you. The Bookstagrammer Planner grab bag has already sold out and it's only been a minute. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Oh my gosh, this is going so much better than I thought. Oh my gosh. Oh my god. Thank you so much. 
bitch. <laughs> I'm speechless. Oh my gosh, thank you. Wow. Okay, things are going fast. <laughs> Alright, so we still have everything in stock, thankfully, of uh, except the books or grammar planner grab bag. It's only been three minutes. <laughs> Holy moly. Thank you guys so much. To, to anyone that placed an order for this launch, thank you, thank you, thank you. I, wow. <laughs> Alright, so I'm trying to see how much we have. Okay, so that's, how much did I start with that? Oh my gosh, that went down fast. Look my grab bag, how much should I start with? Okay, these are going fast. Oh my gosh. I can never begin to say thank you enough for everybody's support. 91 active cards? Hold up, you need to see this. 96 active cards right now? This went so much better than I honestly could have hoped for. Oh my gosh. Wow. Uh, 103 active cards. Thank you. I feel so grateful right now. Thank you. Wow. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> I don't think I've had this many people on my site for a launch in a while, really. It's... We didn't even have this for the last shop update. <laughs> I seriously have like the best time with grab bag sales because I have so much fun putting them all together because it's a surprise what you guys get. And I just have so much fun like curating basically these fun little bags of happy goodies for you guys that <laughs> I just have so much fun with it. <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm, this sounds weird to say, but I'm so excited to go back to work next week so I can pack everything up and just send you guys happy mail. <laughs> Thank you. Okay guys, so I'm gonna stop the video here. Thank you guys so very much for hanging out with me this week. I hope you enjoyed this video. The mystery grab bag sale is still going on. So we are literally so close to being sold out of the regular mystery grab bags. So I am so happy and just thank you so much to any one of you that placed an order for the grab bags. I cannot wait to send them out to you and get you some happy mail. And I'm gonna try my best to do grab bag sales more often. Obviously, I can only do them when I have oh, like overstocked products or retiring designs or a good accumulation of oopsie products in my oopsie bin. But I'm gonna try to do those more frequently because I know you guys really enjoy the mystery grab bag sales. So yeah, so that is it for me. Thank you guys, I I am, thank you. Uh, this, this sale went honestly just so much better than I thought it would go. I was hopeful it would go well, but I didn't know just how well it would go and I honestly feel like I could cry because it's just like sometimes it's a bit nerve-wracking to rely on social media for your livelihood for hoping that your posts get seen because your business survives off of it so um it got a bit nerve-wracking leading up to it but I am so happy that it was seen by the right people the people that were interested in it and it just everything went well so I could not be happier and thank you guys again so I hope you guys are doing amazing and reading some even more amazing books and I will see you guys in my next video bye <music>